be with you. And, and also, also with, with you. you. Welcome to this all age service. Judas Iscariot, a long chain of 12 paper people. Those were the names of Jesus' special friends, his disciples. God the Father forgives us in Christ and heals us by the Holy Spirit. Let us therefore put away all anger and bitterness, all slander, and malice and confess our sins to God our Redeemer. Father you come to meet us when we return to you. Lord have mercy. Jesus you died on the cross for our sins. Christ have mercy. Spirit you give us life and peace. Lord have mercy. May the God of love bring us back to himself, forgive us our sins, and assure us of his eternal life. In Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. There was so much to do. So many people needed to hear about God's love. Jesus needed help. He said to his twelve friends, Go and tell the people of Israel that the kingdom of heaven is near. Go and make people better. Give to them what has been given to you. Jesus said to them, don't take any money or spare clothes or a bag to put things in. People will look after you. Stay where people make you welcome and leave the people who don't want you to stay with them. Glory to God, glory to God, glory to the Father.
Glory to God, glory to God, glory to the Son. truth help us to keep your law of love and to walk in ways of wisdom that we may find true life in Jesus Christ your son hear the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ according to Matthew glory to you O Lord Jesus went through all the towns and villages teaching in their synagogues, proclaiming the good news of the kingdom and healing every disease and sickness. When he saw the crowds, he had compassion on them because they were harassed and helpless like sheep without a shepherd. Then he said to his disciples, the harvest is plentiful, but the workers are few. Ask the Lord of the harvest, therefore, to send out workers into his harvest field. Jesus called his twelve disciples to him and gave them authority to drive out impure spirits and heal every disease and sickness. These are the names of the twelve apostles. First, Simon, who is called Peter, and his brother Andrew. James, son of Zebedee, and his brother John. Philip and Bartholomew. Thomas and Matthew, the tax collector. James, son of Alphaeus, and Thaddeus. Simon the Zealot and Judas Iscariot, who betrayed him. These twelve Jesus sent out with the following instructions. Do not go among the Gentiles or enter any town of the Samaritans. Go rather to the lost sheep of Israel. As you go, proclaim this message. The kingdom of heaven has come near. Heal the sick, raise the dead, cleanse those who have leprosy. Drive out demons freely, you have received, freely give. This is the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, O Christ. Our Father. Yes? Sorry? Who was that? It's me, God. You called. At least I assumed you were calling me as you said, Our Father, which is one of the names I answer to. Are you really God? Yes. Talking to me? Yes, well, you called, and I answered. You were, I believe, doing something you call saying my prayers? I was. I thought I was meant to. Well, it helps to talk to me, if that's what you meant by meant to. But I'm not keen on all these shoulds and oughts. But I thought, you know, about rules and everything. Yes, a lot of people think that. And other people think I'm some great, rather stern man in the sky. I'm not, though. I'm not a man, for a start. In fact, you don't have to say, Our Father. As I said, I'm not a man, and it's just that most religious leaders are men, so they decided I am too, which is rough on women, on non-binary and intersex people. You could say, Our Mother, for a change. Or just call me love, because that's what I am. Gosh, this is a lot to take in. I know. Take your time, though. You have all the time in the, well, universe. Oh, okay. Um, love, who is in heaven. And on earth, and everywhere, in you as well. Oh, okay. Love, who is everywhere. Hallowed be your name. Oh, 
What does hallowed actually mean? Holy. My name is Holy, or honoured. Though I like it when a child gets it wrong and says, Harold, be thy name. It's a good name, Harold. Go on. Um, your name isn't Harold, is it? Oh, sorry, that's a silly thing to say. No, as I said, call me love. Okay. Your kingdom come, love, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. There you go again, about heaven and earth. They're much the same, you know. Heaven can be on earth too, though it's up to people like you to make that happen. People like me? Yes. If we're going to have the kingdom of earth, the kingdom of love on earth, then it has to start with people showing love. You remember, don't you, the greatest commandments. Love God and love your neighbour as you love yourself. That's what it's about. And don't forget to love yourself. I love you. And I want you to respond to that love, to treat yourself well and treat others well. Simple. Okay, well, it, it sounds simple, but it's really hard. Yes, but you'll get it if you keep listening to me. Anyway, go on. Give us this day our daily bread. There's enough for everyone. Daily bread, that is. It's just people aren't good at sharing and humans have set up a system that ensures the rich keeps getting richer. More bread than they need and the poor can't get their share. Bread is, bread is a matter of justice and equality, you know. Uh, I, I guess I did kind of know that, but it all seems so difficult. Which is not a reason to give up. You have to keep trying to do what you can to bring about justice and equality. Even if it's something small, like pointing out inequality, racism, homophobia, the way that poor people are treated, the marginalised, travellers. People seem to think it's okay to pick on travellers, that it's somehow acceptable. It really isn't, you know. And more people need to say that. Keep listening and learning and speaking up. Wow. Okay. I'll, I'll try. I'll help you. That's what the Holy Spirit, my spirit, does. I'm love, but I'm also justice and strength, so carry on. Forgive us our sins, please. Yes, I've noticed you often add please. Of course I forgive you. I keep forgiving, but you have to forgive yourself too. And then you have to keep turning away from the sins and those action thoughts and words that cause hurt. And then there's the next bit. I'm not very good at this bit. I feel, well, I feel angry and then I try to forgive, but then it all just comes back again. Not many people find it easy, but of course that's not an excuse. The thing is, if you carry on being angry with people, holding grudges, going over and over things in your mind, and I know you like to, it's one of your specialties, then you can only feel worse in yourself. Keep giving those feelings to me. I can take them. Remember that I love the people who you need to forgive too. I'll try. Again, I'll help you. Then, then the prayer goes on. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. But I've never really understood that bit, because you don't lead us into temptation, do you? No, I don't. What sort of love would I be if I did? So, so why is it there? It's about reminding you to stay away from things that tempt you and wouldn't be good for you. But remember, I'm there to help you. I can't promise life will be easy, but I'm with you in it. Even in real darkness, keep asking. Okay, I'll, I'll try to remember, but can you keep reminding me, please? That's where meeting other people of love and faith helps. They can support you. You can support them. I'm in them just as much as I'm in you. And you keep reminding each other and helping, helping each other. Well, I see. Um, that, that sounds really good. Carry on. I know you like to complete things. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory. I suppose that might be up to me as well. You're getting the idea. Mind you, there is loads of power and glory in the earth, but humans keep messing up the planet, so that's another thing for you to think about. The planet is glorious and humans are spoiling it. So you need to help there too. You can all help in small ways and these become big ways. Plus you need to campaign against the systems that are causing so much environmental destruction. They are really rather similar to the, to the ones that are keeping the poor poor and the marginalised on the margins. There's a, 
awful lot to do. There always is. Forever and ever? Yes, but first you need the strength to do it. So come on now, just rest in my love and I'll give you the strength and sustenance you need to do your bit. Yours, not other people's. You're one of many. Come on now, rest. Amen. Let us declare our faith in God. We believe in God the Father, from whom every family in heaven and earth is named. We believe in God the Son, who lives in our lives through faith and fills us with his love. We believe in the Holy Spirit, who strengthens us with power from on high. We believe in one God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Amen. Introducing Jubilate. Jubilate. Jubilate, everybody, serve the Lord in all your ways and come before his presence singing and to know his cause with praise. Oh, the Lord our God is gracious and his mercy everlasting. Jubilate, 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 Deo. Jubilate, everybody, serve the Lord in all your ways, and come before his presence singing, enter now his courts with praise. Oh, the Lord our God is gracious, and his mercy everlasting. Jubilate, jubilate, jubilate Deo. Jubilate, everybody, serve the Lord in all your ways, and come before his presence singing, enter now his cross with praise. And his mercy everlasting. Jubilate, jubilate, jubilate Deo. Have you ever thought about bouncing a ball while you pray? Or doing the washing up? Or driving your car? Why not? God is everywhere. So today, let us pray. Jesus sends us out into the world to proclaim God's kingdom and to bring hope and joy to all. Heavenly Father, we thank you for all the gift of life. Help us to break down barriers and to fill your church with love. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Father, we thank you for the diversity in our world and the richness. And we thank you for so many people showing so much goodness at these times. We ask for guidance and courage for all our leaders and for them to take the opportunity at this time to make the place, our place, a better world. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Father, we thank you for the joy of families, and friendships and we pray for all of those who worry about us and that we worry about at this time father in your mercy hear our prayer father we thank you for the people 
doing medical research at the moment into COVID-19 and all other people involved in medical research. We pray for all who are ill and all those who look after them, be it at home, in a hospice or in a hospital. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And Father, we pray for all those people who have died. And we pray for all those who mourn. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And Heavenly Father, we thank you for listening to us whenever we pray. Heavenly Father, accept our prayers for the sake of your Son, our Saviour, Jesus Christ. Amen. Let us pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done. On earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins. As we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation. But deliver us from evil. For the kingdom. The power and the glory are yours. Now and forever. Amen. We are all one in Christ Jesus. We belong to him through faith, heirs of the promise of the spirit of peace. The peace of the Lord be always with you. Peace be with you. Peace be with you. Peace be with you. For I'm building a people of power, and I'm making a people of praise. That will move through this land by my spirit and will glorify my precious name. Build your church, Lord, make us strong, Lord. Join our hearts, Lord, to your son. Make us one, Lord, in your body, in the kingdom of your son. For I'm building a people of power and I'm making a people of praise. That will move through this land by my spirit and will glorify my precious name. Build your church, Lord, with a strong Lord, join our hearts, Lord, through your son. Make us one, Lord, in your body, with the kingdom of your son. peace of God which passes all understanding, keep your hearts and minds in the knowledge and love of God and of his Son Jesus Christ our Lord. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you always. Amen. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord. <laughs>